What's going on guys, it's Ideal Play here, and in today's video guys, I got you guys a brand new video on the best loot cave out there. Now, I have made a bunch of videos on a whole bunch of loot caves that are all after the patch 1.022, and I'm going to show you guys which one of those loot caves is actually the best spot, and I mean like the best um, spawn rate, uh, the more engrams they drop, and there are actually better spots than the others where the enemies actually spawn a lot faster, you actually get more engrams, and I've noticed this just by doing all the loot caves. But before we get into this video guys, make sure to drop a like, it always supports the video. Let's try to reach 100 likes on this video, that would be freaking amazing if we could hit 100 likes. And then also subscribe if you're new because I upload daily Destiny content, but without further ado, we can jump into this video. Alright guys, so my favorite loot cave, slash the best loot cave, is the one on Venus. Now where we're going to go is just simply around this little loop, and it's very easy to get to. Just follow where I go in the video. If you've already seen this loot cave, then you know exactly where it's at. But I'm just letting you guys know, this one is the best loot cave. And I mean like, it actually drops tons of engrams, and you can actually do it by yourself. Now, I would say that the one on the moon, where the knights spawn instantly and the ones come out of the cave is the best, but what I noticed doing that one was, the enemies do not always come out of the cave, and that is a big problem because that's where you get most of your engrams. You don't really get a whole lot from the knights, and if you do, they're mostly going to be the uncommon, as where the ones that come out of the cave are the ones that are going to drop all the rare and legendary engrams. Well, they don't always come out, so that's a deep a defect to that loot cave. And also, it's not really solo because it's really hard to quickly pick off the people that do. Once they do come out of the cave, you can't really kill them fast enough. They'll just try to hide behind the walls, and then you also have these knights that blast these things at you. So it's not solo. This one on Venus is actually solo, and you can actually get close up to the enemies. You're not sniping and using your scout rifle far distance. You're like right next to them, you can just blast your auto rifle machine gun into their face, kill them very fast, and you actually get about 15 to 20 drops of engrams. Probably three rare, and the rest will probably be all uncommon. And then every once in a while, I would say every hour you do this, um, you probably have a chance. Uh, I would say if you do it for an hour, you might get one legendary engram. You're not going to get any more than one. If you do, you're pretty lucky because... I actually only get one like every hour I do it, but I don't always get one every hour. Sometimes it takes two hours, sometimes it takes just one hour, sometimes I even got one just after like 30 minutes. So I hope you guys did enjoy this video, remember we're trying to hit 100 likes on this video if you did enjoy, and then also subscribe if you're new because I upload that daily Destiny content guys, but without further notice, I'm Ido Play and I'll see you in the next video, peace!